Hi, this is Marion Robertson from B Sweet Nature Company, and today we're going to discuss dogwoods. I want to start a series on the dogwood family, and the first one we're going to talk about is the beautiful Cornus alternifolia. Now, the name does make sense because pretty well anything that has opposite leaves is a high probability dogwood and of course this is the exception she has alternating leaves here you go so the alternating or the alternate leaf dogwood is the very first one to ripen it is now early august and huge for wildlife you can see the lovely purple berries and as fast as they ripen, the birds are eating it. So dogwoods on a whole, as a species, are listed as very high for functioning in an ecological system. They produce immense flowers. So in the earlier part of the spring, you will have lots of nectar and pollen for your pollinators. And then, of course especially with this alternating branching. I've been trying to find a bird nest, but it's great n nesting habitat. And then, of course, you get this bountiful berry production that the birds and all wildlife love. So if you're thinking of having a dogwood, try this one. It's like an upstanding, smaller, understory tree. So it can take partial to full sun, semi-drained areas, but it's something you can tuck at a forest edge or a shadier part of your yard. So won't you consider planting alternate leaf dogwood? Till next time, bye-bye.